Aloha Cousins Briar 626 here, and today we have another unboxing of another Bahugan pack here. This is a triple pack of the Chaos Hydorus here. Um, so we get, of course, the Chaos Hydorus, Darkest Dragonoid, and the Aquas Trox. I was wrong when I first saw this. I thought it was Fangzor, or Fangzor, I'm sorry, Aquas Fangzor, but no, I was wrong. This is Aquas Trox. Um, so yeah. Um, so that that video was wrong. I, I was wrong. Sorry, but there it is. He's right there So let's go on ahead and get into the unboxing here of this Bakugan So we are here, of course, with this Bahugan here, this Bahugan triple pack here. If you do want to see the kind of story behind how I got this one and the other two that I had, um, the Diamond Bahugan set and the other um, triple pack that I had, go ahead and click that card right there. It's actually a really cool story and some really cool stuff happened. I thought it was really cool, so I had to share it. Um, and of course, have to share opening this because this is really cool here. So yeah, so of course you get the Chaos Hydorus Ultra. Darkness Dragonoid, Aquas Trucks, the Bahu Cores form, and the character cards, of course, which you get three character cards, three ability cards, the six cores, Bahu Gun, difficulty of one. We already have a Hydorus Ultra, or two of them, really. So it's really cool to get the Chaos version, and of course, how they look like when they open up. So yeah, so the simple stuff here. So let's go ahead and open this box here, or this packaging, get them out of their shell, and open them up. Oh, that was a great one. Throw that one, yeet. Um, and then let's go ahead and get that open there. Eh, there we go. Get that. Get that. Get that out of here. Add, get out of here. There we go. All right. Let's go ahead and pull the actual box. Two of the box we got here. One box we got, and the character cards, of course. Um, let's go ahead and get everything in the package because I don't like it being in the package here. Pick that up. Eh. Cores. Um, let's get those out. Cores are out. The Bakugan themselves are out. I'm going to have to push this one out. Ready? And there we go. Next one. There we go. One I've already popped open. That's perfectly fine. We'll get him out of the way here. Um, get him out, out of the way. And then our last one here. Hi, Doris. Perfect. That was like super easy. I'm going to stick you to the side. And then, of course, our cards here. Get that out. There we go. Get the tape off. That sticky tape. And get our cards out. Of course, you do get the instructions on how to play the game. And the instructions on how to close Ultra High Doors and a checklist. But we don't need any of those because we already have them. And we already know exactly how to play. So yeah. Alright. So let's go ahead and start with our cards here. So of course, we get the Darkest Dragonoid. Yeah, he's one of my... Uh, he looks like really cool there. I like the way that looks, um, and he's kind of like the one reason why I bought this set was just because of the Darkness Dragonoid. Of course, he does get a Fire Fist and a Orange Shield, 400 B power, and 4 damage. Still stronger than the original, um, by all means, he's the strongest one, or not the strongest, but one of the stronger ones. Then we have Hydorus Ultra Chaos, uh, for 2 Orange Shields, uh, he does have 200 B power and 4 damage. So a little bit on the low side, but still not too bad. He does some forward damage, so that's pretty good. Um, so that's pretty cool. Uh, then we have the Aquas Trox here. Um, you do get the uh, two different shields here. You get that blue shield and the orange shield. He gets 200 B power, but seven damage. So that's actually a really good high damage count there for that low B power. Of course, that, m that matches the Pyrus Dragonoid's B power. Um, but the damage, it, it outbeats Dragonoids quite a bit. Um, so yeah, so then we get the ability cards here, uh, with them. Uh, so we get, uh, Accelerate for one energy, uh, draw a card, it's a flip card. Then we get Dark Fire for four energies plus nine damage. And then we get Stoic Shock, Shot for two da or for two energies, draw a card, and then if you hold the most Bahu cores, you get to draw two cards instead. So those are the two cards, or the three cards we get there. Uh, then our cores that we get is, of course, one Fire Fist, uh, plus six damage. Ooh, 
that's 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 a, that's a pretty good one there. We're gonna we're gonna put that one. That's a pretty good one. Um, then we get our orange shield. Uh, if you are a Chaos or Ventus, plus 400 B power. So if you're running a Chaos or a Ventus or both, this might be a good one for you. Um, so that'd be pretty cool. Um, then of course we have the blue shield, which does plus 600 B power. That's pretty good there. Um, get some good high B power boost. The uh, orange shield here, another orange shield. Uh, minus 300 B power. Ooh, that's a trap one right there. You don't want to land on that. That would be good for your opponent. And another trap here, minus 200 B power for an orange shield. So you get two traps um, type course. And then the other shield is plus 100 B power. No, 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 no. Really? So you get minus three, minus two, but plus one. All right, sure. Yeah, yeah, that, that, that's, that's right. You can do that. I, I get, uh, whatever. I don't, uh, okay, sure. So then of course we have our Bafu gun here. We have the darkest dragonoid here i don't have the pyrus dragonoid with me i would show you what they look like but um if you don't know what they look like go on ahead and click that video right there it shows the unboxing of the pyrus dragonoid um so yeah so this is what he looks like here he's basically like the same color but black and purple instead of blue or not blue blue and light blue is the aquas one um the orange and red one so you can see his b power there and see what he looks like right there. So he's pretty cool looking. I don't know. I, I like this color. I like this color scheme. Of course, I wish it was like black and red. That would be really cool. That'd be like that evil dark look. If they if they make a black and red one, Hasbro or not Hasbro. Why do I say Hasbro? Spin Masters. If you make a black and red Drago, um, that's either Pyrus or Darkus. Let me know. Send it to me. I, I would love to have that. That would be like the coolest color scheme for him. I think it would be black and red there. The black body with the red highlights. Yes, please, please make that and send it to me, please. That would be amazing. I would love it. So I'm going to go ahead and close him up here because we'll turn to get him open uh, here in a few. Um, close him up just like that. Simple and easy. All right. And then, of course, we have the Aquas Trox here. Um, now, I'm pulling out his hands because his hands are manually pulled out. You do not, like, they don't spring open, so you have to manually pull them out, which is which is fine, I guess. Um but you know it, it still would be nice if uh if they did spring open but you know hey is what it is uh 200 b power at the bottom there you can see kind of what he looks like here you can see how hollow he is inside there um so yeah he looks pretty cool um of course we did the diamond version of him um the video before this so yeah so this is pretty cool to get the aquas version so yeah so let's go ahead and close him up of course fold the arms up fold the legs up close that down and then the head here just like that boom voila simple and easy then of course we have the Heos Hydorus here um of course he is like the white uh lion um you know i've I, I noticed this um but if i can get all of the ultras of Hydorus, we pretty much would be having the uh all the lions for voltron i mean that that's just me i i don't know why i think it's funny is that all these almost remind me of the uh, Voltron uh, lion. So each line you get is like a Voltron character. So like we have the uh, we have the uh, Aquas, we have the Pyrus, that's the red, and the um, the red and blue. We need the yellow and green and a black, the black one. So yeah, so we can try to get all the black, all the lines, so we can do that. And then of course the white one here, which doesn't really have a line, but you know, hey, it's still pretty cool there. So of course the 200 B power. And let's go ahead and close them up. We've already seen the, um, of course, we've already seen this one before. If you want to see that video, go ahead and click that card right up there. And like I said, I've already closed enough of high doors. I mean, I've closed him up like multiple times here. So I know exactly how to close them. Of course, I'm having trouble here because, you know, I, I don't talk when I do this, when I close them up last uh, most of the time. So, you know, hey, this time I'm like, hey, guess what? You're having trouble with them. So we're going to give you trouble. You're talking. And yeah, we're just going to give it that trouble. Um, why? There we go. There's that. There's that arm. If we can keep him in that arm there, that's fine. Don't do it. And then, of course, closing it down. There. Perfect. So yeah, so now he's in his ball form. So yeah, that's what he looks like there. So I'm going to go ahead and set up these cores here. I'm going to set up the cores. It doesn't matter what they look like because we're just going to stick them up here. And hopefully they pop open. I'm going to stick that right there. 
take those cards to the side. So we're going to take the Darkness Dragonoid here. He looks like he still has that, that little head issue, but it's not as bad as the other ones. Um, take the arrow. We're going to roll it that direction because that's the way we wanted to pop. So ready, Bakugan Brawl. That failed. All right, let's try it again. All right, Bakugan Brawl. There we go. So that is the Darkness Dragonoid opening up there. Darkness Dragonoid. Let's go ahead and do the Aquas Trucks here. You can see the arrow is right there. So we're going to roll in that direction. Ready, Bakugan? Brawl. Missed again. Let's try this again. <laughs> brawl. Come brawl. Be on one side. Hey, okay. won't you? Oh, there we go. We did it finally. We opened him up. It took forever. That's a hard one to do there. So we're just going to set these record these cores back up, reset them a little bit here, so we can get that pop open action on the Hydors here. So here's Hydors. The arrow is right on top of his head there. If we can see the glare. There we go. Roll it that direction because that's where the arrow is pointing. And Bakugan brawl. There we go. So that one popped open, uh, kind of like jumped there. Um, sometimes they jump and flip depending on how fast they go or whatever. So yeah, so that is it there. So let's go ahead and put them back here. So that is the unboxing guys. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, make sure you click that like button down below. Uh, and if you are new, make sure you click that subscribe button and become a cousin in our family. And remember, Ohana means family and family means no one gets left behind or forgotten. And I will see y'all next time. Bye.